Hey, this is Michael Feldman here in New York, and I'm here to share with you uh, a traveler's or interchange style routine where the jacks start separated in four different pockets, and one by one they change places with the aces, and it's got a surprise ending that I think you'll really like. We're actually going to take you step by step through the whole routine and show you how to do it. So we start out with the jacks and aces. The jacks will just start right there because I think most people would like to start with the aces, you know, the higher value cards. That's not really my style. I like to start with the jacks. And normally, in a traveler's kind of effect like this, you would take the four jacks, place them into the deck, and then they would vanish from the deck and end up in the four pockets. But I just like to start this out by, you know, just placing them in the pockets. It just seems, seems easier to me. So, what goes there? One jack in each of these pockets as well. And then we come back to the aces. And the idea is to get the aces to change one by one into the jacks. It looks just like that. There's the first ace to change. And in case you didn't get to catch that, we'll do it a couple more times. There's ace number two. So that's number one. That's number two. Number three looks a little bit different. Just like this. There's ace number three. And ace number four has already changed, actually. But you have to wonder if these are now the four jacks, where do you suppose those aces are? The answer has to be one of them is here in this pocket, one of them is here, one of them is here in this pocket, and the last one. Oh, actually that's one, two, three, and that is the fourth ace. But if those are the four aces, where do you suppose the jacks went? And of course that means one of them has to be right here. One, right here. One, in this pocket, and that all four.